Tiger Lily Squad. Wait, let me put y'all down a little bit. What's poppin'? What's poppin'? What's poppin'? What's poppin'? What's poppin'? What's poppin'? What's hey? What's poppin'? What's poppin'? What? Hey, hey, she poppin'. What up, Tiger Lily Squad gang? Gang, how you living? How you breathing? How you feeling? It's your girl. Essence of Shay, how y'all doing? Yo, I feel like I ain't sing that song in forever. I feel like I ain't come out with a hair video in forever. Um, really and truly, it ain't really been much to record. Because once I do the protective style, that's literally it. I ain't doing nothing after that. But um, in today's video, um, we are what a month away dang i swear to a lot at the gym today a month away two weeks away i'm not quite sure from the time where we are starting our new set are we excited i am ex so excited um so i just took out my marley twist uh, mainly because the rubber band portion was popping out that was ghetto um yeah so i'm going to wash my hair but i'm going to also be coloring it but i won't be permanently coloring it i'm gonna do a semi-permanent using the as i am um curl color this is not a sponsored video i just kept seeing mad people use this um and like styling their hair afterwards and you guys know i'm new to all of this so styling the hair and all kind of stuff i just watch youtube videos and then i do it myself because i'm not oh oh allergies oh child because i'm not about to pay nobody an arm a leg and my first kid's kidney to do my like i'm not about to do that but um i am going to try out the rice water um my rice water looks like this mainly because i use brown rice because that's all i had when they say rice water they specify that i needed to be white racist i'm joking i'm joking y'all i'm joking and then to cut the smell i put in pep uh, peppermint 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 tea leaves or whatever um i haven't smelt it yet let's open it right now i ooh, 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 ooh. Ch child that stank that smell like boo boo oh it's not that bad it's not it's not that bad it's not that bad it's not that bad i'm it's not that bad it's not that bad it's not that bad it's not that bad so what i'm going to do is transfer this to a spray bottle and then i'm going to spray that in my hair and then well i'm going to transfer i'm going to spray it in my hair on camera i'll i'll be i'll be right back y'all like that is definitely a strong scent like sheesh my god but yeah i'm just gonna this is my first time using it um this is my hair she long boy oh she long girl um so i'm just gonna spray that i just like saturate the hair Uh, massage it in that's what you're supposed to do right oh my god that stank child that stank nah oh oh my god all right y'all so i put it all over my head and i massaged it in i made sure i got every strand i sprayed it a bunch of times so i have shower caps which I'm super excited about because they actually fit my head, bruh. So I'm gonna let this sit for 20 minutes. Y'all excited? I'm excited. All 
All right, y'all, so I washed out the rice water and I also shampooed and conditioned my hair. Um, let me pull this rug back a little bit. So right now I'm going to do um, a treatment and this is from My Black is Beautiful. Uh, I'm just gonna put it all over my hair, like comb it through with my hands and then put on a stocking, I mean a shower cap and then um, just kind of sit with it. I'm gonna start at the edges first. I feel like I still smell that rice water and I think it's because of the shower cap. So she gotta go. Mm -hmm. So I uh, just finished washing the treatment out of my hair. Mm -hmm. That's how she's looking. Still able to rake my hands through, so that's a good thing. First things first, y'all know the drill, leave-in conditioner, Camille Rose Honey Hydrate. Hands first. And I'm gonna put a little bit of this conditioning cream by My Black is Beautiful. Now for the fun party. So the directions of this um, uh, color says that damp or dry hair, but not soaking wet. So, I think this is not soaking wet. I think it's a good consistency. I need to dry my hands so I can put on these gloves. All the years y'all see me um, coloring my hair, this is the first time y'all see me use these gloves. So after 11 freaking years and one ripped glove, we have it on. Jesus. Like, it should not be that difficult. How am I not prepared, honey? Towel dry. Hair must be dry or damp, not dripping out before you use gloves. Section hair off, apply damp hair from root to tip. Use a generous amount based on thickness. Twist and wrap. But, ghetto or not, it's gonna come out good. I ain't worried about it. I am not worried about it. You worry about it, cause I ain't. You worry with yourself, girl. Oh, it don't stink. Oh, and I'm using these perm rods that have some kind of black stuff on it. I don't know what that is. Can you see the color? That's just the amount I used that was on the little paper thing. It says from root to tip. Rake through. I feel like to me that's the easy part. The hard part is putting um that damn perm rod on. Struggled with my locks. So then take the perm rod. And what I see the YouTube people do, they just kind of just wrapped it around. Uh-huh. Then they did a thing and then a thing. 
Child, it's about to come out. It's gonna come out good. What I said, it's gonna come out good. It's gonna come out good. Section number two. That section might have been too big. Mm hmm. That that might have been a big section. Oh, I can't see what I'm doing, but I'm showing y'all. This is ghetto. I hear you. I hear you, Shay. This is about to be cute. I hear you, girl. Thank you for, you know, the added confidence, you know. I already knew it was going to look good. I already knew it was going to look good. Okay. So, we are just a mess. The phone, y'all know I, the phone is a mess. I'm a mess. Every, it's just a mess. But um, this is my first time. I like to be honest with y'all. Some people like to lie. I ain't about to do that with you. I'm about to tell you the truth. Um, so some of my perm rods, like the white ones, I don't know what the material or like what the expiration date is on them, but some of them, like they're popping as I put them in. So then I have to take them out. It's just a mess, girl. It's a mess. A mess. So I, um, I'm still confident that they're gonna come out good. Not the best of the best on YouTube, but they gonna come out good for a beginner who ain't never do this a day in her life. Yes, ma'am. So this is my last section. I'm thinking about splitting that in two. Or just, no, nah, I'll just leave the one. So what I've been doing is just taking it at the root. Like it says. And then raking it through with my hands as though it's like a gel because that's basically what it's supposed to be like it's almost like a styling gel that's why they said you can just do wash and goes with it right um so i'm just raking it through and then once i get to the tips see that i'm gonna add a little bit more Got this thing all over my forehead. I hope this is easy to wipe off because, honey. Okay. So then I have some smaller perm rods um, because, like I said, the other ones are making popping. So what I've been doing now is putting it at the top and then wrapping it around, holding it and just wrapping it. Uh, all the way to the end. I tried to smooth out, but yeah, they, all of them are not smooth. So this is it. Ciao. This is it. So it says to go under a hooded dryer. So that's what I'm gonna do now. Well, I'm gonna clean up and then I'm gonna go under the dryer. Whoa. Whoa. This look like blonde in a sense. All right, 
Let's get the taken out, shall we? I definitely see some kind of gold. Max mad, could you lost the brick inside the porch? Goofy with the